Hello everybody and welcome to another edition of Drew's Food Reviews. And today I was out and about and I decided to stop by some place for some chicken. And where I went was official, apparently it's the official wings of the Golden State Warriors. Wing stop. Can't stop wing stop. They have new, two two new flavors of chicken and i got boneless wings and for uh, i got a five piece i got two five piece orders of boneless wings i suppose i could have gone on a different day when they were a little bit cheaper but uh, i combined a bunch of stuff today so anyway for a 10 piece order i got half of the one and half of the other it was 9.49 plus tax 10.37 so there you go and they could you could get the regular ones and they were like ten ten dollars and nineteen cents or a little bit more expensive for the the bone-in wings and the two flavors that they have are get these right names are kind of tricky ancho honey glaze boneless so that's what i got and the spicy harissa lemon pepper Okay, so that's what they are. And here comes, here's how the order was. And they, um, you can get a combo, you can get it with the fries, with the ranch, with all the other stuff. And here's what it, it looks like. This is the harissa lemon pepper on this side, and this is the glazed ancho honey one as well. And I didn't get any ranch, I didn't get any blue cheese i didn't get any fries i didn't get any of that stuff because frankly they charge you 99 cents for a um a thing of ranch or a thing of buffalo sauce and i don't think i should have to pay for ranch or buffalo but anyway i'm gonna go ahead with the the ancho one i think the ancho one's more hot and the other one the lemon pepper one is not as hot so i'm gonna go i'll go with the lemon pepper that's kind of like a dry rub it's got a lemon pepper and I guess it's um, this harissa sauce on it. And here we go. I'm going to give this a try for you guys out there and see how it tastes. If it's really hot, if it's spicy, what, what exactly it tastes like. So here we go. The lemon pepper harissa. Hmm. Oh, wow. Ooh. got some kick to it it's got a nice flavor mm. wow that um mm. wow hmm i'm getting a lot of lemon pepper on that there's kind of a background of the i guess that's the harissa it's kind of like a smoky chipotle kind of flavor to it it's not spicy it's got a good burn actually the coating's um done nicely mm. oh yeah wow that's good i get that flavor good again although it's a limited time i don't know how long they're going to be out but that's actually good it's not it's a dry rub they're nicely coated on there <laughs> and it's actually pretty pretty good now for a dry rub and i can i taste a lot of that pepper a lot of the lemon pepper a lot of the other things so now here is the this is the ancho honey glaze you can see the glaze on there and here we go i'm gonna give that one a try and find out how it is this is probably going to be a little bit hotter than the other lemon pepper i'm getting more burned from like that lemon pepper than i am from that harissa spice or or whatever other spices on there just a little bit of a tingle a little bit of a pepper but this is probably going to be a little hotter ancho chilies <laughs> it's not as hot as their atomic sauce that's actually pretty hot so here we go ancho honey glaze chicken from wingstop mm. Mm. Oh wow. Oh wow. Mm. 
Wow. That one packs a punch. Mm. Mm. Oh, wow. Oh, wow. <laughs> okay. <clears throat> Warning for those who do not like hot stuff. Don't get the ancho chili. It's real close to their mango habanero. Kind of that sweet, sweet flavor with a lot of spice on it. Wow, I'm really getting some burning from that. Um, wow, that ancho chilies. Ooh, this is hot. I'm telling you that 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 is um, it's comparable to their mango habanero. Where that kind of like lingers and it's burning on the back of my throat and yeah so i can see that that one oh wow yeah Whew. hot stuff guys so i think i'm gonna try this one more time because i kind of cut the flavor now my tongue's kind of burned out on that <laughs> so one more time this is the ancho chili one wow hot mm. wow nicely nicely coated mm. and that sauce is actually very tasty it's a little sweet but it's got that background of the the hot to it wow that's really good um the uh sauce on that wow I'm not gonna lie, <laughs> it is pretty hot, and I'm getting like a lot of uh, background burning to it. I like the sweetness. I like the the hot hot flavor to that. No. Yeah. Mm. Okay, guys. <laughs> getting a little hot so wow i'm gonna go ahead and rate these individually on the flavors because you know i don't know it's mostly just a new flavor of the sauce the chicken itself you know from wing stop whether you like the boneless whether you like the bone-in wings it's all going to be the same kind of chicken it's just a little sauce that's different so I'm going to give you guys a rating for the lemon pepper harissa one. That was actually pretty good. So I'll give that one a, give that one a 9. 9 out of 11. It's not bad. <clears throat> I like the fact that it's the dry rub. There's a lot of pepper in there. A little bit of smokiness from the, um, the harissa. And it wasn't too hot. It's it's actually pretty good sauce. Well, it's pretty good to rub coating on it. And it's not extremely hot. And it would be, you know, I think it would be okay for people that aren't into the too hot stuff. So that's my rating on that one. Now, the Ancho Honey Glaze one, that one was a different story. That's a hot, that's hot one. Oh, wow, that's... Still a little bit of burning from it. It's not like extremely hot. I think their mango habanero is a little bit hotter than this one, but it's comparable to it. It's a sweet heat. The glaze is good, but it does pack quite a bit of punch on it. So if you're not a fan of the hot, I would suggest don't try this one. Don't try the mango habanero. Don't try the atomic. Don't try the, uh, whatever the blazing. I don't, I don't even know what their uh, scales go go up to but this is on the higher end it's a little bit hot i'm still sweating so for that flavor the ancho honey glaze i give that one a 10 out of 11 it's not blow my socks off like 11 out of 11 off the chart it is a good blend it's the sweet the heat it is a little bit hot but not overly hot so, 
If you're a lover of the heat, give that one a try. Also, you can go with their mango habanero, which is similar to this, and they have that all the time. Also, if you wanted a real challenge, go with the atomic sauce. <laughs> That's actually pretty hot. I've had that, and yeah, it's uh, it's a real uh, tongue burner. So, if you've got a, a wing stop near you and you want to try their new flavors, go ahead and give them a try. You can get, like I said, you can get them on certain days. They're cheaper. You can get them a combo. You can get them in a, um, individual ones. You can get them as a, like a family meal. Um, you just have to go to your, um, store and look, uh, see what, uh, their pricing is and they'll break down. Sometimes they offer a local special, a deal on certain days and they're a little bit cheaper. I think it was like, uh, Tuesdays and Thursdays where they had 60 cent boneless wings. So that might be a, a good option, but otherwise these are pretty good and I probably would get them again if I go back to my wing stop and give them a try. So yeah, if you like the video, give it a thumbs up and don't forget to hit the subscribe and the notification bell over there. That way you won't miss any future content or next time I go live. And also if you have any of your favorite flavors at wing stop, Leave me in the comments down below and let me know what your go-to sauce is or your go-to type of wing is. Or if you don't like Wingstop and you like Buffalo Wild Wings or you like some other um, wing place that's near you, go ahead and leave it in a comment. Let me know what kind of wings you like. So, yeah. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, when I'll be trying something new for you. And I'm going to go ahead and finish these off. <laughs> Because, yeah, they are, they're pretty good. They're a little hot. And like I said, the least I can get was like a 10-piece. So I had to go I had to go with the 10-piece. I could have got like a 3-piece tender, but, yeah. I wanted to try both sauces, so there we go. So until next time on Drew's Food Reviews, I'll talk to you later.